So there was this place, Land of the Danes, and King Hrothgar ruled it, and Grendel attacked the Midhal Herat, killing Danish warriors and sometimes eating them. Beowulf, a young Geat warrior, travels to the Herat from the Geat lands to help out and kill Grendel. And, and and he fights Grendel, and, and in the fight, Grendel loses his arm. And and then he, Beowulf uses that arm as a trophy. And he hangs the trophy in the meat hall. And then uh, Grendel's mom gets pretty angry because, you know, Grendel's dead. And so she steals the arm, right? And then, and then, uh, Beowulf gets pretty angry, you know, his, his arm has got stolen, so, for obvious reasons, he went and killed Grendel's mom. And then, uh, he emerged as a hero, because he killed Grendel's mom with an ancient sword built for titans, I think. Um, and then, uh, after that, Grendel, uh, no, not Grendel, Beowulf, becomes the king of the Geatland or something. And, and, uh, and there's a dragon. And this dragon is menacing the town. But, but Grendel's old. Not Grendel, Beowulf is old. And, and he has to fight it, but he knows he's gonna die. And and he goes and fights it, and his shield starts melting, and he, he like looks behind him and like, oh no, everyone's gone. But like Wiglaf comes to the rescue and saves No, he doesn't save Beowulf actually, Beowulf dies. But he does kill the dragon, and Beowulf says in his final words, I need the 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 gold and stuff. I need a tower boat. And I need all the gold from the dragon buried under the tower. That would be good. And uh, and then he died. And Wiglaf built the tower and buried the gold under it. And so ends the tale of Beowulf.